Hey all Ryan here from Planetary Lapidary, and welcome to another episode of Lake Michigan Fossils, where I just go over a little bit of information on fossils that I find on the western shore of Lake Michigan. And today we're doing my favorite one that I find there, um, stromatoporoids they're called, or sponge fossils is what they are. Um, and these little sponges lived, you know, 65 to about 145 million years ago, so they're fairly young compared to a lot of the other fossils that we find in Lake Michigan. Um, they have some very telltale signs to be able to tell them from other things. And it's going to be that wispy layering in every single one of them. You know, they come in all different shapes and sizes. This is a little one here. All different host materials as well. So this is like a quartzy material. This one here is sort of like a sandstony material that kind of got included in there another quartzy one this one's like a little churdy churdy and some quartz for that one but you'll always see those layers on there another telltale sign is just the shape of these things so they'll always be kind of shaped like the top of a mushroom like this this is a really good representation you know that's kind of how they grow right there the stem would have been down here and it just kind of eroded away this one actually had a little inclusion in there too but this is another good representation of how they actually grew so this would have been the stem and it would have grown up right like that so that would have been the full thing so kind of easy to pick out um, when you're looking at them on the beach they're very wispy most of the time they're translucent you know quartzy or crystalline stuff um, sometimes you can find peelers like this, so you can really see how the layers were formed there all the way down to the bottom where the stem would have been there. So yeah, all in all, probably my favorite fossil. I love what the insides of these things look like. I love what they look like when you polish them up. Um, so hopefully this was a little helpful to you in identifying some on your own rock hunting adventures. Um, I'll, as always, leave some pictures at the end of some close-ups so you guys can kind of see. Um, I'm gonna do some of ones I actually threw, uh, threw through the tumbler. So you'll be able to see what those layers actually look like when they're shined up. So uh, leave a like if you haven't, subscribe if you haven't. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next episode. Thanks again, bye.